A stadium alive with atmosphere and two teams ready to commit themselves to excellence for 90 captivating minutes. We're privileged to be here on an occasion that resonates with football fans everywhere. And if you think you know who's going to win, you are courageous indeed. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from London here on EA TV. And a warm welcome from North London, we're at the Emirates Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal versus Brighton and Hove Albion. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And Kai Havertz. An Arsenal corner. And deciding to go short with this one. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Pascal Gross. Jakub Moda. Possession one. Havertz. Ben White. And now with Tosar. Chance to cross. Tosar. Textbook defending inside the box. Pascal Gross. And Feldman with it here. No foul play, says the referee. Made it look routine, but read it well. Kai Havertz. Martin Odegaard. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control, but quick thinking defensively. Welbeck. Trossard, and he's through here. Going for the chip. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And then the finish is really good. He just dinks it over the keeper. That's an excellent goal. Back underway, 1-0 it is. Pascal Gross. And passing it well. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? a bit of conviction and straight into the wall now the corner here and that might boost their hopes <laughs> 
Who can they pick out? Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Still looking to get the shot off. Just not looking confident in possession. Just lost his focus. Throw in here. Nicely timed tackle. Adam Webster. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Welbeck. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Saka. And Havertz. Martin Erdegaard. Well, it's a decent-looking attack, this. Well, disappointing end to the move. Trossard. Tomiyasu. He's going forward well here. How about the cross? Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Tomiyasu. And back with Trossard. Rice. And defensive play to be applauded. Pascal Gross. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Well, patient passing could be the key to bringing themselves level. Oh, maybe the equaliser. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. Time that will close the book on the first half here at the Emirates. Well, a slightly underwhelming performance from Bukayo Saka, if we're being 100% honest. Well, he's such a clever player in and around the box, but he just hasn't received it enough in those sort of areas. He's got to work harder to find space for himself, that's for sure. Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. It's looking promising. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Martin Odegaard. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Declan Rice. Thomas Partey. 
Brighton doing well to regain possession here. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, Beck. Opportunity. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Who's going to get on the end of it? Could still be dangerous. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Arsenal's free kick here. Tomiyasu. Trossard. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. Well back. And a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. Oh, blocked it! Now, do they mean business on this occasion? He's blocked it! Well, no surprise there. Brighton have been in control over the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Well, let's see if they can win the ball back and create something else. It's a perfect challenge. Rice. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. And reacting almost instinctively. Great defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Pascal Gross. Gross. Here's Gross. Can he play it in? And forward go Arsenal. Do they have a late winning goal in their future? Havertz. Nice. Oh, surely. Oh, that's a splendid save. Well, so late in the game. That's a magnificent stop. Substitution time it is here. They take it short. And another corner, hot on the heels of the last one. Coming off the pitch, number 19, Leandro Trossard. Coming onto the pitch, number 11, Gabriel Martinelli. Going short. Rice. Gabriel. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Needed to be more accurate from the keeper. Spot on with that tackle. Well, Arsenal have to get the ball forward quickly now. The crowd are demanding just that little bit more effort. What a finish we've got on our hands here. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. There to take it away. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. All even, but will it stay that way?
Pascal Gross. And Sufati. Can he put it away? Well, the keeper has pulled out all the stops there. Well, it's a great chance to win the game, but what a brilliant piece of goalkeeping that was. It's an outstanding save. Let's see about the delivery. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Bukayo Saka. That's a well-struck pass. Possession ceded by Brighton. And the referee blows the whistle. Still all square at the end of 90 minutes.